Hello and welcome to our YouTube channel. Today, I am going to be going over the new Ranger Megamin. Megamin's attack stat is 20% higher than that of Amelia, establishing her as one of the highest raw damage dealers. At 9 stars and at level 180, Megamin's attack stat is 4,661,020, which surpasses both Rock Brown and Amelia, both of which had the highest attack stat before. Megumin's attack range, which is 500, is much further than both Amelia and Rock Brown. With a longer attack range, she is able to dodge more skills from other rangers. While Rock Brown has nullifying debuff canceling skills and cancel buffs, Megumin's attack skill and raw damage potential sets her apart as a strong damage dealer, along with her stun. However, her buff skill, which buffs skill hit and skill use rate, is a little bit worse than Rock Brown's, which also buffs skill evade. Furthermore, Megumin's abilities include Deployment Freeze, one of the strongest abilities in the game, and her 9-star ability has the unique capability to nullify skill resistances, enabling her to ignore Void Ranger's skill resist. With both Deployment Freeze and Nullify Wood skill resist, she is good for training troubler teams and annihilating Wood-type rangers, such as Eren. Despite her strengths, her skill range, which is around the same as Rems and Jax, she is lacking compared to other fire DPS, like Levi or Ainz, who can hit the back. On the other hand, Rock Brown's skill targets only the back, bypassing the first few ranges and hitting the backliners, easily killing them. She has a high damage skill, but since she does not hit the back, she may fall off in the future. In conclusion, Megumin is definitely stronger than the average ranger. She looks like she can be relevant in the meta for at least 6 months, but I don't see her being irreplaceable like Eren, although this is just speculation. It is recommended to get her right now, but since next month is January and that's when the light and dark rangers come back, you may want to save your tickets for them instead. However, if you have enough tickets, try to get her. But, do save some for the Light and Dark Rangers for next month, and don't worry if you miss out since she isn't really needed if you already have Ainz or Levi. Thank you very much for watching, and see you in the next video.